So you're ready to find out why this um, apartment is 2800 and what could be so different between the one downstairs. So let's see together what it has to offer. So it's on the top floor and you're the only tenant on this floor. And the living room is 12 by 20. So it's pretty good size. And I like the ceiling. So it has this um, high ceiling with the good lighting and cool lighting stuff. And it's, it features the balcony, which is, comes right off your um, living area. And it's facing east. So you actually, you should have good morning light from here. It's actually not facing east, it's facing north because it's the back of the building, so you're not gonna get a light from here. But as you see, it's not that dark. So even though it's facing north, maybe because there's nothing is blocking. So it's pretty good space, that's your entrance. And the way you could work this room out, I probably would put TV here since it has the outlet and I probably would put the big couch over here. And uh, maybe the dining table would go right here because it's right next to the kitchen. So we are in the kitchen and the uh, kitchen here is also not as spacious, but it comes with the new fridge, uh, which is actually opening in the right direction this time. So from the penthouse, they kind of thought about it a little bit at least. Stove, stove thing. It's um, not the biggest one I've seen, definitely. Uh, does it have exhaust? Yes, it does. All right, so it has exhaust for cooking. And the uh, window, this window is facing best so you do have afternoon light from this window um comes with a sink and it's a dishwasher dishwasher it's not a full size it's uh on a smaller size but it, it, it works and that's view from the window that window in the kitchen actually could be used um very convenient way because it opens up and it actually opens up to your private terrace so that's the, actually the reason this apartment is 2800 and you can serve food from here if you do make a party so let's check out the room so I said before once you come out from your apartment you're the only tenant on this floor and you have a skylight which brings you a lot of light and you can take this step out and and that's your private terrace that is facing the south. It's actually um, all these penthouses, they do have private terraces here. And uh, it seems like they don't have any divider here, but you could put something here to divide yourself from the neighbor next door, as long as it's pretty sturdy, maybe like some bamboo separation tall uh, and not gonna fly away with the wind. That we do have windy days sometimes in New York. Um, that, that's interesting. It has a kind of like extra balcony. I guess you can go to, if you want to. And that's your view. Step. Maybe you can close this off and uh, use it as a pool in the summer. <laughs> um. That's your train passing by on 31st Street. Um, it's, not, it's, not, it's not as bad. So that's how we come in to back to your apartment. So let's see what the rest of the apartment looks like. So closet number one in a hallway. Closet number two in a hallway. A uh, bedroom with the window and air conditioning and closet number three in the bedroom. Comes with the ceiling fan in the bedroom window. And amazing view of the city. <laughs> the building right next door. But but it's a bedroom, probably a lot of people would prefer other people to go look at their windows in the bedroom. So it also comes with a thermostat, which is easier to control. You don't have to turn anything, so it's not gonna break. And this nice blue colored bathroom. Uh, it's a um, good closet, it's a good space for the cabinets. 
you know I never understood uh, why all these cabinets would open one direction whether let's say if this one could open this way you can actually put them both of them open and have have it more convenient let's rather than like this which is this one right in between this could be open from the other side but as I said, that's for, you know, other states where the people thinking about convenience in New York. Um, yeah, <laughs> New Yorkers is not spoiled and never going to be. So it works. Has a window. In a bathroom, window is always good, so it's not going to get moldy or anything. So it's pretty clean. Um, the sides. Yeah, so let me know if you think this is worth the 2800 uh, or not for the terrace. The landlord actually also uh, offering here a uh, one month free, which is uh, gives you the net rent of 2600 per month instead of 20. So stay with me and I'm gonna walk on 31st Avenue all the way on 31st Street to the subway station and check out the neighborhood. Let's see what kind of cafes, restaurants, is there is any gym, and what kind of neighborhood in general story is maybe you would consider so to you're passing by, this is a um... Uh, family dentistry which is uh, looks like it's closed but this pharmacy is open and I think it's brand new because when I was living here it didn't have this pharmacy here uh, some cafe which you could get the coffee Greek cafe and uh, and daily daily I think is open hmm, those machines don't look good though food wrap never heard anyone I'm just not sure if they're open in a COVID but looks like those ones are so a lot of people actually are getting the gyrus right on this corner. It's been here forever. And you see, it has a big plane for it. They have this um, gyro place here for like years now. And I've seen them go from like a little truck to actually a big truck because I lived right on this corner for a long time when 31st and Broadway. So I've seen them grow. I think they even at some point added the ATM machine so you can withdraw the money right in the back of the truck. I'm not sure it's still, still there. As I said, today is not the um, warmest day to, the, to do the tour, but I made it and I'm back. Uh, so let me know which one would you um, rent for or which one would you not? Um, do you like this location or not? Is uh, do you like a Broadway side or Dittmar side person? And if you do decide to take a tour with this apartment or any other apartments with me or with any of my agents, please. Um, like this video, comment, subscribe, and you can either send me an email or you can send a direct message and see which apartment you would like to see. Uh, we all wear masks, um, use the hand sanitizers, we still show apartments in person and take people on the tour. The only thing we don't do anymore is to drive clients in our car. We used to do this all the time, which clients loved it and would save us and them tons of time. But unfortunately, we can do this now until hopefully there are better times. So you will have to go between apartments on your own, but that's the only inconvenience um, to, uh, until now. So let me know and see you in the next video. Bye.